how's everyone doing? Um, decided I'm going to do a weekly vlog. It's Tuesday. Um, but I want to start today's vlog off with saying there is... How do I put this into words? There's nothing worse than getting a bunch of packages on one day when you live with your parents. Because I just got a bunch of packages today and of course, they, like literally the shipping things, they were like, oh, um, it's not going to come till this date or it's not going to come till that date. So I'm like, okay, I'm getting so distracted. But yeah, it's like, oh, this isn't going to come till this day. This isn't going to come till that day, whatever, whatever, right? Um, yeah, well, it lied to me and most things came today, which I'm not mad about, but like, I feel like my parents are going to be like, girl what are you doing save your money and i'm like guys i'm filling a void obviously um but i want to show you what i got one thing from h&m which i fun fact about this little okay i can't find my actual scissors so i'm gonna use these eyebrow scissors to be honest like i genuinely don't know where they went like i cleaned my room the other day and i just couldn't find my scissors after that like did i accidentally throw them out because they were good scissors Anyways, I don't know. But I ordered this H&M thing and I genuinely forgot that I ordered it because I got an email and it was like, oh, um, updates about your H&M package, like why it's delayed. And I was like, did somebody hack into my H&M account and buy something? And then I was like, oh no, I did order. I did. Okay, this these scissors are not doing it for me. Like, oh no, I did order something. Totally forgot about it. But... I ordered this like cream top shirt that cardigan thing. Um, how do I explain it? I don't know. I guess I can like try it on if I feel like trying stuff. We'll see. But it's like that cropped. Why does it look huge? It's an extra small. It's like a cropped shirt thing, you know? like cute right like cute with like an all black set or like a black workout set or something but yeah that's what i got from h&m i got it in an extra small um super cute then i got two pairs of shoes from or boots from two different stores so the first ones i'll show you are from zara and i've been wanting a pair of boots like these for so, uh, so long for so long guys so i was like you know what i got the email that they're back in stock and i said secure checkout continue with payment you know i got these bad boys are you kidding like this is a cute ass fall boot okay this is a cute fall boot over the knee leather we love to see her but they're so cute and it's not like a super big because i've seen other ones that are over the knee that are like the heel and i didn't want that so i'm excited for these then i got a pair of shoes from public desire which I've never ordered from there before, but my friend Angie has, and now I have, so. But I wanted to get a pair of knee-high boots, like not over the knee, but like knee-high, like cute booty heel things. <sighs> like, I'm sorry, how cute are these? And they have a little like silver detail, can you focus? Like a silver detail. But like, how cute are these? Oh my God, where am I going? I don't know, but I might need to hit the town with these bad boys, you know what I'm saying? I'm not spending any more money unless I need to. Like I just, there's nothing else I genuinely need. That's my problem is because I think I need everything, you know, or like I want everything and then I'm like, just, you only live once. No, Maya. Like you do, but stop. So I need to get out of the habit of spending money. Yeah, so I just wanted to show you that. Um, so I am probably just gonna go back to finishing up some work because that's what I've been doing today. And I'm also watching Gossip Girl while doing so because I'm a multitasking queen. Um, so I'll see you guys later, maybe. Oh my God, guys, I'm back. It's later in the day, um, not doing well. I have the worst headache of my life. I've had a headache for like four days in a row convinced i'm dying but that's not what we're here to talk about what no i don't even care about my hair right now okay what i want to talk about right now is the new update that's coming out for animal crossings i need to discuss it my friend ella 
so they had that like direct thing i missed the stream and i because i got the dates mixed up and i was so sad so she sent me a video and i kid you not I wanted to pass out the whole time like the whole time like i never wanted it to be november 5th so bad in my life because i am genuinely so excited no one will be seeing me that weekend nobody will be seeing me that weekend okay the amount of updates that are coming to animal cross i can never sit through a like a 20 minute video without my attention span piecing out you know what i'm saying like i cannot i cannot i cannot i cannot i watched that whole video and i did not take my eyes off the screen okay well i did because i was texting my sister while it was happening first thing that's coming is brewster and the roost which is like literally brewster and then he has a cafe in the museum you know you know how excited I am about that? Um, Harv's Island. Basically before Harv's Island, wasn't really much. You know, you'd go there, do a couple things, and like, oh, now on Harv's Island, like other island visitors, so like Reed, which who, never comes to my island, right? I restarted, and he has not been to my island one time. So if anyone wants to give me a tip on how to get him there, that would be lovely. You'd be able to cook now. You can have a like a little garden farm, like a farm, and then have a garden, and then you can grow vegetables and stuff like that and you can cook you can grow tomatoes wheat sugarcane potatoes carrots what else can you cook and you can make things veggie sandwiches soup pizza but no one is gonna see me after this update like i'm letting you guys know that right now like no one is seeing me after this update because like why why would i leave my house now that animal crop like now that i can just you know what i'm saying yeah she's on my ride she's my best friend okay and then there's this paid thing called happy home paradise and if you think i'm not buying it you're wrong you're wrong um i already told myself i will be and i'm sticking to it so i know i said i need to stop spending money but i that's i meant for this month for october it'll be november basically you can go to new island like islands and like renovate homes for people you can customize like inside people's homes and like to their liking they can like give you like an idea of what they want and then you like make it for them and then you get these things called you'll be paid in things called pokey and there's like a shop there where you can use your pokey currency and buy stuff and you can bring it back to your island I think I'm way too excited. Like, is anyone else this excited? I feel like people are this excited. I just wanted to come on here and talk about Animal Crossings. I have a really bad headache, so I'm gonna try to nap quick because I'm going out later. Um, okay, I'm gonna nap now because she's pounding and I keep talking. Mm. Anyways. Hi. Um, I feel like I'm missing something. I have my laptop. Okay, I don't care. Um, hey guys. Today's Thursday. Didn't film yesterday because I just had such a busy work day, but a productive work day. I was filming content with clients and stuff like that. Um, if this shakes, I'm gonna be pissed, but honestly, whatever. I am going to help Angie run some errands. Um, she has to go to Ikea and then, yeah. Um, so I'm hoping to do that because I'm a good friend. <laughs> Angie, if you're watching this, I'm a good friend. Honestly, I'm not feeling the greatest. I'm not gonna lie to you, but it's okay because life doesn't stop just because you don't feel good, you know? 10.24 in the a.m. I'm tired, um, but it's fine. We move, you know? But it's finally starting to feel like fall here in Ontario. And I'm living for it because, oh, you can't see me. I'll continue to, whatever. And I'm living for it because um, I'm like, I love dressing for fall weather. I love fall, like it makes me so happy, but it also makes me kind of sad because then I know winter's coming and I don't do winter. Like, no. I thought I would just like take you along my little, I'll just do a little car vlog. I'm probably not gonna vlog in like Ikea cause like vlogging in public like kind of gives me a little bit anxiety. And I don't know if I'm mentally ready for that yet. So I don't think we're gonna do that yet. Um, but maybe in the future when I'm like, you know what? I genuinely don't care what people think about me. Um, I say it now. Oh, yo, the best thing ever. 
the best thing ever is when a light is like it's counting down and you're like okay it's gonna go yellow and it go it stays green and it stays green because that just happened to me um what was i saying yeah like I, i'm like i maybe when i'm like i don't know when i'm like i don't really care what people think about me because yeah now i'm like i really don't care but like i think like deep down i'm still kind of like mm, i don't know if i'm comfortable and that just stems from anxiety but um yeah have you guys listened to adele's new song because i have it on repeat every single day so i think we should listen to it i love this song adele doesn't miss who are we honking at who are we honking at? Because if you're honking at me, that's not how it works. You can't honk at the bus because the bus has a right away. The bus always has a right away or else it's a fine. So, Mister, what's your car? What is your van? You're actually stupid. You're you you Toyota Sienna. You actually don't know what you're doing. You don't know what you're doing. Why am I why am I yelling at a driver? It's literally 10:30 in the morning. Maya, calm down. I love this song. I love this is probably one of my favorite songs right now. I genuinely love it so much. I don't even care if it's overplayed. I. Block the intersection. Yeah, 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 no, like it's your world. It is your world. Just block the intersection when you know you're not supposed to. Wait, wait, I need a backup camera. I need a backup camera and I need it now. I don't know how to park, guys. Like, I really don't. Like, street parking and me. I don't deal with that. Hi, besties. We got Starbucks. What'd you get? A grande iced chai tea latte with oat milk and pumpkin cream foam. Oh, we love to see it. So splendid. I got um, a cinnamon dolce latte because I've been obsessed with them lately. I literally got one the other day, and ever since I've gone to Starbucks, I think I've gone to Starbucks every day this week and got a drink. But that's what I get. And I get oat milk, no whipped cream because dairy who? We don't do dairy. We're going to go to Ikea, maybe Home Sense. Hopefully, Home Sense. Hopefully, Home Sense because we love Home Sense. And then what else? That's it. Popeyes. Mm. Popeyes. We want to try the Meg the Stallion um, meal sandwich meal thing. I also got kettle potato chips. Salt and vinegar flavored. Okay, we're gonna go. That's actually true. When is kettle home. chips? Yeah. Because regular chips are like deep fried. So what is a kettle chip? Or not deep fried, but they're like fried. Are they? Yeah, right? Yeah, because kettle chips aren't as greasy. I don't know. Well, I don't know. They're gonna taste we good anyway. We gotta Google it. We don't know anything. This man's gonna hit this woman. <laughs> At least we vlogged. At least we vlogged it. <laughs> At least we got it out of the video. Got Imagine. Okay, we're gonna go um, do our little errands. Maybe I'll see you in IQ. It is 354. I look disgusting. I don't even want to talk about it. Um, going home, my throat is one fire. Uh, went to Ikea. I got a like a drawer thing with like pull out things to go under my desk because I have my desk doesn't have any storage. So like I have no storage in my room to put like my desk supplies and stuff like that. So I got that from Ikea today and I got these really cute mirrors that I want to put over my desk because I think that would be adorable. You know what I want to talk about? I want to talk about me. <laughs> but no, like actually, like I want to like start doing more things for myself. Like, does that make sense? Like I keep seeing people like my age, like, okay. Like I want to start, like, it's not that I want to start adulting. Can I go? Yeah. It's not that I want to start adulting. It's just like, I'm an adult. Like, okay, I'm not like, I still consider myself, I don't consider myself an adult. Like I am, like I'm 23, that's an adult. Like have a full-time job, like yeah, I'm an adult. But like, sometimes I see like, even when I see like influencers, it does, I can't relate my life to an influencer because like they have money and like investing. We don't live like that. We don't live like the influencer. Um, but like what I'm saying is like seeing like them just be like so independent and just like driving themselves places and like doing more things by themselves. Um, I want to start doing that just like being more independent I guess what I'm saying mom if you're like watching this still make my appointments please cuz don't want to do that I have genuine phone anxiety and I hate talking on the phone I do really want to start doing things for myself um, like even if it's like small things like going to the coffee shop in the morning why am I saying coffee shop like I'm not gonna go to Starbucks going to Starbucks in the morning just to like get a coffee or like 
I don't need like I, I, don't, I don't really know or just like running my own errands like not like making people do them for me like if I'm like need to do something but I don't want to go out because like I'm stressed like you know um like I need to start being more independent but I also don't want to but like even like things with like content like I really want to take like my Instagram up a level and like posting more because I'm doing a lot of reels and stuff this pimple is irritating I'm doing a lot of reels and stuff like that on my Instagram like starting to do reels because I think they're genuinely so fun to make and like obviously like making like TikToks and stuff like that but like on my Instagram um I want to like start posting more but like all the place like the, like my area is okay but like I want like even like just going downtown like if I want to drive downtown for a day and just like have a whole bunch of outfits and like posting like stuff like that like having a bunch of like just taking a whole day to take pictures and like in different locations downtown because downtown is such cute spots to take pictures and like all the cute aesthetically aesthetic places that you see downtown or on instagram are downtown so that's what i want to do but like the thought of i hate driving downtown like it just stresses me out so i never drive downtown so even if it's just like me taking a bag and ubering downtown and just like going to different spots like i don't really like the subway so i don't want to do that either it's like hard because like i get so like in my head about things and like ugh, it's just anxiety is not fun and it gets so stressful and i never i don't like talking about it anxiety and stuff like that because i'm just like it's not in, like i don't know i just okay, i'm like mm, that's like personal stuff about me and i hate discussing i do enjoy being alone like i love being like hanging out with my friends and stuff like that my social media runs out so low but i genuinely just love being by myself and doing things by myself um so i need to just like start doing that in public you know i'm home guys okay so oh damn i shall see you guys when i'm inside building ikea furniture i hit my head taking out this stupid ikea box okay uh this taking this out by myself and bringing it up to my room was the hardest thing i've ever had to do in my life i almost passed out and i hit my head taking it out of the car and my head is not well like she's not doing okay um so am i concussed probably but you know what life goes on okay so it is currently 4 30. i think i'm recording tonight at 9 so i have time to build this ikea thing i want to do that now i'm probably going to try and organize some of my room i just like need like a five you know but like my room's messy like i have a water bottle right there there's no reason for that i have stuff over here my desk she's she's a mess so that's why i got this organizer because then i can keep stuff like little things here and there in it so my room is as cluttered and i think i can fit it under my desk or even beside it so we'll see so we're gonna do that now um and i'm so excited this is not gonna be easy i'm just taking this in respectfully i've never like built anything like by myself um so this is gonna be so fun for you guys but i think i can do it what is happening Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, got it. I was very confused. These are the sides. I was like, I don't get this. But yeah, I get it now. It, it, makes, it doesn't make you feel any better, but it was also huh? the worst time ever for me. I literally don't know what to do with this thing. What do I do with this? What is this? Why does an Ikea put words in their instructions? You expect, like, I am a picture person, yes, but you expect me to just understand this through a picture? Besties, progress. We're making way, we're making way. All right. Oh, this is the bottom. I'm a liar. Anyways, gonna continue this. I'm so excited. My mom just came home and she's gonna be like, girl, what are you doing? I'm gonna be like, girl, Bob the Builder. I'm Bob the Builder. <laughs>
complications. I did it, and like the drawers pull out. Like, I'm so excited. I'm very excited. So like now, because my desk is like super short, so like now I can put like some stuff on here. Like I can like move the light here, like whatever, and have just like more space on my desk. And then also have like storage. She's cute. So I'm gonna pretty much organize that, get stuff settled in there, and then clean up my room a bit. Hi besties, it is Friday. Um, one oh four. Um, honestly, all I've been doing today is working. It really wasn't a weekly vlog. It was a Tuesday, Thursday vlog. But anyways, I'm gonna end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. If you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. That'd be very nice. But anyways, I'm gonna go finish work, do some things. Call it a day. Bye, guys.